Hello everyone and welcome back to my daily report market analysis videos with me Richard Perry Market Analyst at Hantech on Tuesday the 21st of January. Looking at Euro dollar which is just, I mean just hanging on really. Uh, you've got this bullish trend of the past three, three and a half months um, which has been basically linking all these high lows um, or a basis of the higher lows whereby weakness has been bought into throughout those three months. Now that really did get a question mark yesterday because with we broke below the 11083 mark which was the previous January low now this sort of continue this run of this last 3 weeks where we've seen lower highs and lower lows but now we're back at this level and look at the confluence of this level this uptrend comes in around 1075 the key support of the first higher low of this run higher comes in at 1065. That first high low is crucial because if that gets broken, you then start to break that, certainly the, the sequence of um, higher lows, which means that you're building a new trend. Now that new trend would be exacerbated by the fact we are, I mean, as you can see in, in this current three week trend of lower highs and lower lows. So that would become a, a more of a prominent trend. So below 1065 would be a key moment. Now, Euro dollar is just hanging on, I think, basically with the fact that we've got momentum indicators still around those levels, aren't they? The RSI, um, throughout that run higher, RSI sort of found um, bottoms around the sort of 40 area. It's just a shade above there now, but look at the MACD lines coming back towards neutral. Stochastics going below the 20 line now. That is the lowest since November, so it really is sort of make or break territory for this run higher now. Um, all these moving averages, look at that, the 55 day moving average flattening off, the 21 day moving average flattening off. So it's all suggesting that these mo the market is at a tipping point. It could go either way um, and uh, the, the outlook could be a, um, significantly different in the next day or so. Now, at the moment, we're hanging on to this uh, the point around 10.75, which was yesterday's low. And a failure to break back above 11 figure is an interesting development as well because 11 figure on the daily chart has been a basis of a pivot for the last few months really quite often turning around at that point and sort of moves through that on a closing basis tend to be sort of outlook changes so it's a really important um, time I think for euro dollar so breaking below 11 figure and holding that break is not great and as I said 1065 is the key level we need to look out for so it is on the brink on euro dollar and i wish you good luck in your trading today and i'll speak to you later click here to subscribe to our videos and go to our website to sign up for our webinars